Hey, what's happening, ladies and gentlemen? Steven Davidson here. It's shave video, one of two. I've got about maybe five days worth of beard growth, give or take. The itch is starting to kill me even after a shower, so the beard's got to go. So let's go ahead and get started. I'm going to prep my face off camera with my usual suspect, Barbasol 1919 Leatherless Shave Cream. Good stuff. I've had it soaking in hot water, boiling hot water, and I have my coffee mug, Mr. Coffee Mug Warmer out for hot lather, but I'm going to go with my Omega 10049 Professional Boar Brush, 26 millimeter knot. Fourth, uh, I'm going to go with um, Blackland Vector Single Edge. Again, this this has become my go-to razor. I love it. With a light safety bar. And fourth shave on a Pro Shave S blade. Fantastic. And to start today's party, Soap Commander Endurance Classic Spice. This is a vintage, 1938 vintage Old Spice type scent. Fantastic by Shelton Company. And we're going to finish it off with the matching aftershave balm, which adds a touch of menthol. And modern day old splash, old spice aftershave splash. You me. And uh, when I come back, I should be fully prepped and lathered up. So stand by. I will be right back, ladies and gentlemen. Okay, I'm back. Yogurt, anyone? Look at that nice, thick, hot lather. I don't know if you can see it or not, but it is steaming. I got a tiny bit of water down in my mug to keep it from drying out. In fact, I'll put a little bit more. Not too much, but enough. Okay, now for the Blackland Vector Single Edge Light Bar Safety Razor. Fourth shave and counting on a Pro Shave S Blade. Fantastic. Oh, it's going to feel good. Happy little lather accident there. Getting it falling all off of me. That's fine. Hope everybody's doing well, feeling okay, doing well. Got to see Paul's video, first use with one of these. He loved it. And that's kind of fulfilling. I kind of really had a feeling that's what he was waiting on. I kind of knew about it in advance, but not too much. But he wasn't too happy with customs on that one. They held his razor up, and I don't blame him. I'd be mad about that myself. He gets... Very nice first pass. And of course, Soap Commander. You guys know my feelings about it. It's my go to soap for a reason. Let's rinse up. <laughs> Fantastic shave. Happy 
in the sofa. Oh, yes, that warm hot lather, man. I'm telling you, when you get a hot lather shave like this, you won't, you don't want that now. Guaranteed. Across the green. Fantastic, fantastic. I'm glad I spent the money to get this one. It ain't cheap. $235 is what I spent. For this razor and a pack of Feather Professional Blades. Shipped. And there goes Zoomer playing with the bag. She got her shots yesterday. She got to ride in the carryall. She did not like riding in the carryall too much. She squealed on the way up there and quit when she got there. And then she squealed all the way home until we let her out of the carriage. So she does not like getting in that little kick, riding around in the carriage in a vehicle. She'll get in it, but she just doesn't like riding in it. Nice for nice second pass, man. We doing good now. Definitely gonna need a third. I can tell I'm still patchy in some areas. <laughs> Gotta use my uh, palm razor for my head shave. The skin guard caught and grabbed right up there and cut me. I wasn't happy about that at all. Didn't bleed too much, just enough to notice and to make me get upset, aggravated more than anything else. That's one of the reasons why I want to get away from cartridges as fast as possible. Oh, the pull the can service gets open my ear. They they make them blades, they don't sharpen them like the ones you get with the razor itself. But when you get the refills, they're not as sharp as the one that come with a razor. And they do that on purpose. So you'll have to go out and buy more blades. Not cool. Quit that, Zoomer. Money pass. I forgot to say the words.
BBS right here so far. A little spot right here. Here's a bad spot for me. I have to buff it at times. Perfect. Perfect, perfect, perfect. That will do it, ladies and gentlemen. I'm going to go ahead and shut her down and get cleaned up. When I come back, we'll recap and fish her off. So stand by. I will be right back, ladies and gentlemen. Okay, I'm back, and let me tell you, BBS, ladies and gentlemen, got quite a bit of sting across the whole face with the alum block, or the Shave Nation alum stick. By the way, Gary, these guys do ship international, and you might want to get you one of these, that way you don't drop the thing and uh, drill you some holes in the cap, and that way your water will drain out and your alum will stay dry. But, uh, yeah, get you one of these, Gary, and I guarantee you won't regret it. Really good alum block here. ShaveNation.com. Tell you what, I'll put the link to it below in the comment section. All right. Let's recap. I prepped my face off camera with the usual suspect. Barber Soul 1919 Lateral Shave Cream. Good stuff. I went with my Omega. 10049 Professional Boar Brush, 26 millimeter night. 10 years old, looks like it's been beat to half to death, but let me tell you, it still produces a good lather, and it's fantastic. I went with my, and Dad Gum, if I didn't leave it in the Dad Gum Barbicide, again. Went with my Black Lens Vector. Single edge. I do this to clean it, folks, and to make sure the blade don't rest on me and all that. I take it apart. And it was the uh, fourth shave on a Pro Shave S blade. Still going strong, as you can see. Had no problem mowing off a five-day-old beard. That's why I like them blades. They last longer. I get about seven or eight shaves on a blade, give or take a little. Uh, it's about the same as I get on a straight razor. People have been requesting one of those shaves. I might do one more, but I'm not sure yet. And to start of the party, good old Soap Commander Endurance. Classic Spice Scent. This is the not vintage 1938 Shelton Company Old Spice. We're going to fish it off with the matching aftershave bomb and the modern day version of Old Spice. We're going to start with the splash first. I always start with the splash because it's lighter than the bomb is and the bomb will take in longer to soak in but this right here will Disinfect any cuts or whatnot and go from there. Oh, man, these smell good. I'm going to be smelling good today, that's for sure. Mm. Fantastic. 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 
double dose it for good times. <laughs> the thing about this Old Spice is, let's so say you wash your face in the morning after you use it in the morning, and you think the smell is gone, you splash a little water on your face, and this scent tends to come back for a little while. Not as strong as when you first put it on, but let me tell you, yeah, it's good stuff. Okay, and now for the, <coughs> excuse me, some Commander Endurance Balm. This adds a touch of menthol. Soap doesn't have menthol in it, but this does. All right. Fantastic. What a great shape, man. Another thing, another thing about these bombs is you can ship them overseas without any regulation or any issues. And they're very good for dry skin and sensitive skin. And especially soap commanders. For some reason, soap commanders products click with my skin real good, extremely well. So I'm happy with those guys. All right, thank you for watching, and I will see you guys again real soon. Take care, and God bless. Later.